If you would like a special Sunday brunch recipe that is super delicious, vegan healthy, and fast and easy to fix, you are on the right video. You're into easy. I like easy. <laughs> hey friends, it's Bob and Fran, your healthy lifestyle proponents and vegan foodies. And today, Fran will give you three of her scrumptious, I know firsthand, brunch recipes that you will love. So let's get right into it. Fran, what's the first recipe you want to give for a great brunch? The first one I want to share with you is what I call my yummy vegan omelet. It is yummy <laughs> and <laughs> vegan. The ingredients are one cup of chickpea flour, half a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of garlic powder, one eighth teaspoon turmeric powder, and one cup of water. Mix those all together and pour approximately one third cup of the batter into a hot nonstick pan. Cook about two minutes and then flip it over and cook two more minutes. Place some sauteed veggies on one half, fold it over and top with your favorite salsa. It's that simple. Boy, it is a great brunch. And by the way, folks, we're gonna have these recipes written out for you in detail on our website at bobandfran.com slash recipes. You could just check in the description box and you can get these recipes very easily. So let's move on to the second brunch. Okay. Maybe my all-time favorite. Yeah, the next one is called Pecan Crusted French Toast. Oh, it's a winner. So here are the ingredients. One and a half cups of non-dairy milk. I use almond milk, but you can use any kind you like. Three tablespoons of cornstarch. One teaspoon of cinnamon. Six tablespoons of whole wheat flour. One cup of finely chopped pecans six to eight slices of whole wheat bread and maple syrup. So what you do is you whisk together the milk, cornstarch, cinnamon, and flour in a bowl. Then place the chopped pecans on a plate. Heat a nonstick frying pan. Dip the bread in the milk mixture and then press one side of the bread into the pecans. Kind of sticks to yeah, the bread. Uh -huh. yeah. Cook on both sides in a nonstick pan and transfer to a plate. Serve this with maple syrup. There probably won't be any leftovers, but if there are, this tastes great reheated. Yeah, we usually add fresh fruit on top. Blue, if you like, sure. Blueberries Whatever or you raspberries. Want, right. Really it's a fantastic really brunch. Really okay. good. Hi, friends. Just a quick break here. Bob and I are very concerned about the dangerous chemicals in our drinking water and how they can ruin our health. So for several years, we've been using this convenient and economical AquaTrue tabletop reverse osmosis system in our kitchen to transform our tap water into filtered and purified water. No installation or plumbing is needed and the result is pure, delicious water. So we urge you to click on the AquaTrue link in the description below and see for yourself how this can add so much to your healthy lifestyle and longevity. Please invest in your health now. And the third and final recipe is for terrific tofu scramble. Again, very easy because I like easy. Take one quarter package of extra firm tofu that you've drained eight ounces of black beans drained and rinsed, one cup of fresh baby spinach, one cup of salsa, and one teaspoon of turmeric powder. Those are all the ingredients, and here's what you do. In a non-stick frying pan, crumble the tofu. You can just do it with your hands. Sprinkle turmeric powder over the tofu and stir. Add in the beans, spinach, and salsa, Heat through and serve with toast and fresh fruit. It's that simple. Wow, fantastic. <laughs> so there you have it. Three good, easy recipes, very healthy, vegan, and it 
great for beginners or experienced cooks alike. And you can see these recipes written out on our website. So check it out below in the description section. And let us know if this is the kind of content you enjoy in the comment section below. We love hearing from you. And you know, it's a big help to us if you subscribe, like us, and press the notification bell to watch uh, an upcoming video. Also, there's a new feature called Super Thanks. It's the button just to the right of the like button. And if you do click that, you could consider making a small donation of appreciation and any amount that you uh, want to uh, donate will go directly to fight child trafficking. You know, that's one of uh, our, our uh, keen interests. And if you're in the mood for another one of our quick videos, stay around for a couple of choices in just a few seconds. Coming right up. Thanks for coming by today. Bye-bye.